U.S. soccer player Kaya McCulloch was due to make her debut in the NWSL this season, but instead she's asked for her contract to be waived so she could pursue a career elsewhere. Her reasons for wanting to leave to escape COVID and racism. Jane Dougal reports. Of our national anthem. I actually started kneeling uh, for the national anthem and solidarity with Colin Kaepernick in like 2017. Already very active in the Black Lives Matter movement, American soccer player Kaya McCulloch was just starting her rookie season for Washington Spirit when George Floyd was killed. For Kaya, everything came to a head. There was days where I would wake up crying, wake up or go to practice crying and then I'd have to kind of not cry during practice and I'd come home and I would just cry for the rest of the day and it was just an endless cycle. I feel as if I can't help anybody if I'm not in a good place myself mentally. She felt with the upcoming election, things were only going to get worse. Plus, Kaya was starting to fear for her health because of the rise in coronavirus cases. She came to the conclusion that she couldn't stay with Washington Spirit or even in America. There definitely has been a line drawn in the sand, um, especially with the election coming up. And it's very tangible when you're in the states and especially as a black woman um sometimes it can be a little bit nerve-wracking people just don't wear masks um don't social distance don't take really precautions so it was really terrifying and especially as an athlete like my career depends on my ability to run for 90 minutes so covid is especially um terrifying in that aspect just because that could be a career-ending injury Kaya has watched the rise of the movement across the world with mixed emotions, but having started her own protest so long ago, felt exhausted emotionally. I thought that it was almost my duty to take on the responsibility of educating teammates and trying to inspire change. And that can be really overwhelming, especially trying to get your footing in a league that you've never played in. There were points where I was asked to kind of compartmentalize what was going on in the world to just focus on my sport. And being a black woman, you can't do that. I can't, I can't take off the color of my skin. I can't um, turn off the feelings of grief that I feel as I mourn with my community. Kaya has now moved to Germany to play in the Freuen Bundesliga, but in a season where she should have been living her dream in her home country, she feels she's been forced to escape a nightmare. Jane Dougal, BBC News.